All right, moving right along to the co-main event. Fighting out of Cardio Flex Gym, please welcome Jed Dale. Here we go. Here, here. Okay, mate, a you you want to get? Man. You want to test yourself? You want to test yourself? You're getting your test when you fight Dolma Fan. Jed wanted to test himself. He's one and zero, and he's taking a tough fight. I really What's have to Dom? take my head on. What's Dom's record? Uh, four and one. And, four and, and one. but you know what? Dom's last three fights were impressive wins against impressive guys. He's been hit one time in those last three fights, and that one hit didn't even hurt. It wasn't even significant. So yeah, if you think that Dom's coming up here for a for an easy fight, you don't know Dom. Dom doesn't want an easy fight. Jed knows what he's getting himself into, so Look, I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. And he's a, I'm looking at his ears, saying he's yeah. a one and no competitor. For sure. No, yeah, look, he's got the cauliflower ears. You know. <laughs> That's how we know where someone's at. That's where you judge someone. Yeah. Don't worry about the tapology record. We just look at their ears. The Gary Spears. Ears and nose. Ears and nose. If their nose is flat. What are you talking about? If their nose is flat, it looks good. What are you talking about? Mine. I've... I've, I've I've had six fights and mine's outstanding. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you don't get hit often enough. <laughs> <laughs> that's why that's because I get them all to the ground. Yeah. <laughs> no, Jed looking ready. And uh, can I just clear up that there will be no bias commentating? <laughs> as uh, I was accused by uh, my mate here, Anton Zaffer. If you're not biased, are you even a teammate? <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. I've, seen, you know I've, what? I've seen Daniel Cormier. I've seen him bloody commentate. My first compliment to, to Dom was probably given tonight. I've never given him a compliment, you know? You're, you're, you're a crap trainer, punk. <laughs> we just keep it very honest. Yeah, yeah, no, definitely, definitely. Betting odds, anyways, if anyone wants to... Uh, the last fight just before I throw out some betting. All right, here he is, Jed Dale. What, what about our betting hot ten? And his opponents. Representing Team Compton, please welcome Dom Marfan. Yeah. One of the best gyms. One of Definitely. the top gyms in Brisbane, you know. Uh, obviously, they've probably been a bit more known for Thai boxing. Yeah. But I mean, over the last year or two, they've significantly made that change into MMA. For sure. Here we go, my man. Training partner. <laughs> Dom coming now. And I mean, not only the fighters, but I mean, if you look at the corner, the experience yeah. in the corner is, is exceptional too. Definitely, definitely. Um, look, I spoke to Dom before the fight. I think he's just going to get done in one. Round one knockout. Let's go. Look at him. You know, he, he really... The, Dom loves fighting, but loves training as well. He doesn't know anything else. Dom hasn't had a job. Like, he hasn't had a proper job yet. Well, a proper job, I mean, he hasn't gone to work to a 9 to 5. This is all he knows. He only knows this. He has come to fight. This is what I wanted to see. And I, what I knew what I was going to see. Obviously, got Steve Compton here, my coach, in his corner. My training partner, Elliot, who's going to... <laughs> he's just throwing a wet rat. Throwing a rip rashy at me if you didn't see it on the coverage, so um, yeah, hopefully we don't get this scumbag back on the coverage. <coughs> Can we ban Elliot from uh, commentating for long? But Elliot, you've just been banned from commentating. <laughs> All right, make some noise. Here he comes. Dom Marfan. Those boys are ready to go. Both boys not cutting so much weight either, you know. I, th I think everyone, you know, we realise here, like, cutting is big, like, big weight cuts, it's not always the answer, is it? No, the, I think I think we get, we're getting smarter. Yeah, definitely. And, and Don likes to push the pace. I think you're going to see here that, uh, yeah, he he pushes the pace. 
All right, this is a 70.3 kilogram amateur oh. lightweight championship belt, Antle consisting Antle. of five by four minute <laughs> rounds. <laughs> Proudly sponsored by Platinum well, Chiropractic. Is, uh, Fighting out of the blue corner, Jed Dale. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, please welcome Dom Ma Fan. All right, gentlemen, we've been over the rules. Protect yourself at all times. Listen to my instructions at all times. If you want to touch gloves, do it now. Come out swinging. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, with co-main event. Make some noise right now. All the marbles are on the line. Dom, trying to find a right, trying to find a home for the right hand. I think that's how he's going to finish it. Oh, he checked that. Oi! Shoot. So he wants to get to the ground. I'd like to see old mate overhook. There's not enough overhooks off that cage. Breathe, Dom. You've got plenty of time, bro. Breathe. Don't get caught up. <laughs> relax, bro. Relax. Breathe. Elliot telling him to breathe. Keep that. He's getting a good position here. Remember you need this, this is his work. This is yours. Yeah, relax, yep. relax. You got plenty of time. Yep. Elliot yep. Compton in the corner telling him to relax, telling him he's got yep. plenty of time. Again. He's nearly got One back here. Down, three to go, Dom. Let him go. Let's look at this. You keep it here for the full three minutes, bro. Keep bombing yeah. those shots in. He's looking for the head. Oh, oh he's yeah. looking for the head and arm. He really yeah, is. Oh, yeah, I think he's not even. Has he got this? No, he's got him out here. He's got to try to finish with a strike. He doesn't want a submission. Wow, look at this. Look at this. This is what I. This is what I was expecting. He, yeah, he needs more than that. He can't stay there, Russ. He is going to get finished. Dom was going to town on him. Plenty of time. Two minutes, Dom. Plenty of time, buddy. Plenty of time, bro. He's not getting up from there, mate. Coach Steve Compton and Elliot telling him to just take his time. Look at that. He's trying to switch. He's trying to pass his. Oh, look at that. Full mount. Yeah, Jed's doing a good job at the bottom day like, to, to avoid being mounted, but it's not enough. He's got to get up. He can't stay down here. This is bad. He is in trouble. He's got a whole minute. Dom's got a whole minute 50 to work here. But this, this is bad for Jed because he's about to get finished. He is about to get finished. Thomas Churchill watching very closely. Thomas is... He's watching closely. Dom's he's having fun. Jez doing a good job switching his hips, but at least he's keeping, he's keeping Dom um, moving, reducing, the, reducing those shots to try and consolidate his position. Uh, he's about to get finished. He is about to get finished. Thomas Churchill looking very closely. Dom Marfan! That's what's up! Dom Marfan, lightweights, lightweights, if you want to test yourself, Dom Marfan, Anton Zaffa. It's not biased commentary when the fight is one-sided. It was essential, it's good. good. We've got a new champ. That is what is up. That's like, what's up. I'd like to see him fight Kyle next. I'd like to see him fight Kyle next, actually. You know, no, I, you know, I, 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 that's got to be his last amateur fight. That has to be his last amateur fight. Kyle. Call me out here and Dom at pro, yes. I, I just, yeah. His last four fights have not been competitive. I, he hasn't been hit once in four fights, I just don't. All right. You know, I, I, the winner of TKO, referee stoppage in the very first round.
and the new 70.3 amateur lightweight beast champion, Dom Marfan. The best lightweight in the country. If any lightweight has a problem with that, you get a chance to compete with him in the case. Anton Zephyr. I think lightweight's, lightweight's a very deep division. I think it's exciting to see him start in some mix. All right, here we are with a new amateur lightweight champion. Must be pretty happy with that. Yeah, yeah, pretty, pretty happy. So, was that the plan? Quick as you can, get it done? Yeah, yeah, just get in there, uh, get out with it. Yeah. So obviously being a championship fight, the camp would have been pretty full on, like leaving it all on the line tonight? Yeah, yeah, for sure. We, we, we never have any easy camps, so yeah, we're always, always trying to work hard, man. That's awesome, man. So tell us, when you're ready to defend it? Whenever, like if, if, if there's someone, you know, game, and looks good enough, I'll, I'll take it. There we go. If they're up to standard, they get a shot at the title. Here's your new champion, Don Muffin. Uh, uh, just real quick, I'd like to thank my teams, Team Compton, Agoji, and, and Base Training Center, uh, my friends and family, uh, my girlfriend, my parents, uh, and especially uh, Steve Compton. Uh, Steve Compton, I, I started training with him uh, about a year and a half ago, um, really wanting to fight, coming off a really bad loss. Uh, I had no confidence. All I wanted to do was get back in there and prove people wrong, though. But he, he, he taught me how to be patient, work on my skills, and now I come in here feeling like a, a champion every time. Push. All right, congratulations. Well, you now are a champion. Congratulations, Don Buffett, ladies and gentlemen.